Mark, how have you been? I've been great. How have you been? I'm good. I'm excited for another night of some exciting Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Gotta love it. Look at all these people in this big room. <laughs> in this massive venue that fits <laughs> at least oh. five people. Uh, so we got Goofy Goober versus Unlucky. Uh, a bird told me that this matchup sucks for Snake. So we're gonna we're gonna try we're gonna see if that matters here. Because um, right. Unlucky is is different, unfortunately for Goofy Goober, but unfortunately for Lucky, they built it. Um, is that is that what we're saying? Yeah, absolutely. Gotcha, gotcha. Um, you know, it's interesting. I don't think I've like I feel like I've heard that like the um, Greninja being a bad matchup, but I'm wondering why that may be. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, but right yeah, off, I think, I think it's because uh, Greninja could kind of just like move in on Snake and. Um, like super easily and just pretty much has overall better boxing tools right um yeah i guess up close uh snake would probably struggle and greninja being as slippery as he is yeah he is around. he's definitely very slippery um but you know they're just kind of playing neutral here um yeah. feeling each know. other out a little bit you know yep. throwing out the grenades as you do uh but, but yeah this this small lead is definitely gonna climb into something much larger um if it's i'm really, lucky to keep it up here i'm gonna go ahead and make a bold prediction and say that whoever takes the first stock is gonna be in control of the game for the rest uh, of the week yeah that's just like a snake thing in general yeah I've noticed is um Ooh, snake is super go, momentum based and if you can't if you can't camp if you can't wall them out if you're forced to approach then you're kind of screwed and we're kind of seeing that here um so yeah unlucky just really gonna be trying to find like how to how to kill here like that is that down throw is good but not gonna get the read for that up tilt the back throw not, not gonna kill quite. just yet Ooh. uh goofy goober doing a good job of avoiding any dire situations here so far mm -hmm. um and with this lead, like I said, like this lead can just, I mean, Goofy Goober can essentially just run away with it because unlucky Pretty much, yeah. playing as Snake gonna have a little bit of trouble bringing this back already on 100% oh. on his second stock. Yeah, this is not looking Ooh. very good for unlucky at the moment. Um, and it continues to get worse. <laughs> yeah. One grab, I will say one grab, and Goofy is dead uh, with like a pummel or two because of that whole, you know, Snake. The 160. Thing. Yeah. yeah. Insane um, that Snake just has a guaranteed kill confirmed. <laughs> yeah, I think that's. Yeah, it's. Ooh, yeah. That will be untouchable. Um, not surprising at all, but. Unlucky well, really 63%, though, so unlucky really. <laughs> or, sorry, Goofy Goober out. getting a lot of mileage out of that stuck. Yeah, unlucky really needs to pull something out here and um, mm. just try and get any sort of footing in this game but Ooh. this is just the goofy show where it's looking like a yeah. circle here and um i'm really liking the frame here. traps we're seeing from goofy like a lot of yeah. these uh even even a lot of things that greninja has aren't necessarily true follow-ups but if you air dodge then they just have something to follow up immediately yep um but yeah wow greninja like goofy just makes greninja look so polarizing sometimes and um it's really cool to see but unlucky and the down tilt won't isn't gonna start anything unfortunately they really need to find a kill now if they want to do anything snake is a heavy heavy dude so Very he's gonna live for a while but um yeah at 110 this is just one confirm into that up smash and goofy goober will be taking this one yep uh doing good job of just sitting in the shield waiting for that missile to run out the nikita yep Forward air sending all the way off stage, and this is looking bad. Unlucky very smartly with a high recovery there. Oh, and the grenades interrupting anything that Goofy Goober was going for. Looking like Unlucky might take this stock here, but will it be enough to take the game? We might not even. Ooh. Oh, reads the jump, but slightly outspaces it. Unlucky really playing with their life here, really trying to just like, you know, not die. Um, and the skin very of their teeth. Oh, jeez. 160% on luck. Oh, and it's just Jesus. so bad. It's just so bad. Multi hits in this game just don't work the way they should, man. Yeah, except for Lucas down air. 
True. And um, that one works a little too well. Yeah, for some reason. And oh, okay. up throw. Up throw. I don't think I've ever seen up throw kill. Um, yeah, I, I wouldn't necessarily like throw kill throws is not something I think of when I think of uh, Greninja, but yeah, at 180 percent. That uh, that forward throw can be like a DI mix up sometimes, but yeah, yeah. I don't know. Yeah, you know, like uh, hazards on Smashville at the very edge of the platform sometimes. <laughs> um, no, but it, you know, it's got the Belmont forward throw effect where it's like it's a decent to the eye mix up. It's fast. Yeah, I agree. I agree. Um, we uh, are taking game one there. Indeed. But yeah, that up throw definitely. I I feel like that might have been the first time I've ever seen that one kill. Mm -hmm. And on Snake, no less. So it can't be that bad. Yeah. Um. Going but, into this game number two, we are sticking to PS2. PS2. Hey, what what do MDVA commentators say about PS2? What is uh, PS2? the same joke that every single one makes? Uh, make uh, PS2 has the best games. Yep. <laughs> and they're not wrong. And Unlucky is going to prove that here by making the best game. This is the best game of Ultimate. This is the best seen. game. Yeah. <laughs> This is, we, we should be advertising this on Twitter, like, if you want to see the best game of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate of all time, yeah. it's Greninja vs. Snake. <laughs> oh my, yeah, ooh, that was, that was nice from Goofy. I yeah, hear. I'm definitely, definitely liking what I'm seeing from Goofy Goober, just ooh. ready for every single one of Unlucky's options here. Yeah, uh, this is, this is crazy from Goofy right now, um, just the amount of pressure is, like, Unlucky is having a really hard time dealing with any of it. Uh, walling Unlucky out, you know, really just the frame traps like you were talking about. Oh my god, the grenade! <laughs> the, the, the awareness to be like, okay, they have a grenade, <laughs> I'm just gonna, you know. Oh, the absolute betrayal Ooh. from Snake's own favorite grenade. He had that one named. Oh His my name was god. Frank. Frank the grenade? <laughs> had him in the back. <laughs> Yeah, I'll, uh, we'll see if Unlucky pulls a Fred here, and, uh, <laughs> but, oh, the going high against Goofy is never, never oh, easy. Man. There's definitely risk. The spacing from Goofy is so good, too. Just, like, barely outranging that up tilt, hitting with the back tilt, or er, back tilt, back air. <laughs> yeah. Um, but, yeah, Unlucky, kind of similar situation as the last stock. Uh, down a whole stock here, really needs to get some footing just needs to get anything. Needs an up tilt, needs a crazy, like, random, I don't know, C4. Yeah, but, this yeah. is looking really rough right now. 150%. Oh, yup, there's the fourth. I told you, I told you that fourth throw. <laughs> fourth throw got the sauce. But, indeed, um, indeed. Not oh, gonna yeah, get the gonna... read again off that down throw. Just doesn't have Goofy's Jeez. option scouted. Getting Goofy hit by the getup attack. Looking like Ash Ketchum right now with this Greninja, but the up tilt gonna send him right back. Team Rocket blasting off again. Doing um, a little bit of stretching before he kicks a frog in the fucking <laughs> gym. <laughs> oh, we got, we gotta love it. Um, <laughs> God, just the context of any Smash Bros matchup is so wild. Like yeah. this is a this is a ninja frog fighting a mercenary in a stadium. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, um, I, I, Sakurai made like a video recently where he was talking about the development of this game, and he like talked about how the recognizability of the characters is a big reason for the success. And yeah, yeah no kidding. Like, <laughs> yeah, he needs to talk oh, about man. that foreigner though. Not gonna kill. <laughs> uh, yeah, Sakurai's next video is gonna be about Goofy Goober's foreigner. Yeah. <laughs> Did you watch KML Summit? Like, what was that? Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> wow, that was that was a great set from Goofy. It, there wasn't really much to say there, except for Goofy just kind of beasting on all of them. Yeah, that was just clean play all the way through. Double two stock.